Another day, another story. The Grand Canyon is a natural wonder that has been millions of years in the making. It was formed by the Colorado River, which cut through layer upon layer of rock over the course of millions of years, carving out the canyon as we know it today. The first inhabitants of the Grand Canyon were Native American tribes, including the Havasupai, Hopi, Navajo, and Paiute. These tribes lived in the area for thousands of years and have a deep spiritual connection to the land. In the 16th century, Spanish explorers became the first Europeans to discover the Grand Canyon. They were followed by American explorers and settlers, who began to recognize the canyon's natural beauty and tourism potential in the 19th century. The Grand Canyon became a national park in 1919, after years of lobbying by conservationists and supporters of the park. President Theodore Roosevelt was one of the park's most vocal advocates, and he visited the Grand Canyon several times during his presidency. Since then, the park has grown in popularity, attracting millions of visitors each year from all over the world. Today, the Grand Canyon is a symbol of the American West and a testament to the power of nature. The park encompasses over 1.2 million acres of land and is home to numerous species of plants and animals, including the California condor, one of the rarest birds in the world. The Grand Canyon has also played an important role in scientific research, helping scientists understand everything from the geology of the Earth to the behavior of wildlife. Despite its long history, the Grand Canyon continues to inspire awe and wonder in all who visit and it remains one of the most popular and beloved national parks in the world. Would you buy Alpaline by click the link below. Thanks for watching.